Ow. You know, Hawkeye, I like you taking initiative and kicking Jill out of her position. No, not that. The one time I want to go into this... No. Yes. Okay. Now then, there's a few more chests in here that I must get to. Because I'm that kind of person. Oh, uh, it's still there. Now I'm wondering exactly how deep this cave will go. It looked like a pretty tall volcano. I'm going to guess five. Five stories down. Until we get to the somewhat base of the volcano. It might only be three. It might be seven. You know what would be appropriate? Make it nine. Nine levels of hell. That's what I want. Make it nine. Nine would be a brutal dungeon, though. Did I get those two? Wait a minute. I did not. Aha, a chance to first strike. Lovely. Pile drive them, and you can do lit. Ah, I've been cracking my fingers a little bit more than I think I should be. Oh well. <laughs> the main thing is, with Hawkeye, I want to hold on to Fire 3. Because I want to use that on the Fire Fiend to see if it does anything. It might. Maybe. But we'll see. I'm going to kill the Fire Fiend and end it for tonight. I've got about an hour and... Maybe an hour and a half before I need to stop and go to bed so I can get up to go to work. And I honestly don't mind doing nothing but Final Fantasy fire fucks. Uh, I don't mind doing Final Fantasy only for like two, three hours straight because I like Final Fantasy. And I get the impression from Billy Deerhead that we're only about 15% of the way done with the game. So, that being in mind... We have a lot. We have a long way to go. However, we seem to be making we seem to be making some good progress. When I know where the fuck to go, we're getting stronger. We're getting more abilities. I think the main reason why we've been doing this playthrough for so long is because I didn't have a lot of healing, and Hawkeye's gonna die, and I'm gonna cry, even though I have life. So as long as Jill doesn't die, we're we're golden. See, we have two lives. We can we can get him up twice. Maybe. We'll see. Blah, blah, blah. Watch, they'll attack Hawkeye. They'll they'll attack him. I know they. I know they're. Ah. Oh, I might be going down below 200 health. Oh no, which is rare. Seriously though, I wonder how. I wonder how strong of a team you could make if you had three fighters and one white mage. That would be a damned interesting team. Because on the one hand, the fighters can use almost all the gear. So they'd pretty much be at the peak of their abilities. And they'd be tanks, and they could all do a shitload of damage to just blow into whatever is in front of them. And the white mage would basically just be there to revive any of them. 700G, 795. That seems a very random number. Is there any specific reason for the amount of gold? Did they just punch in whatever the hell they felt like? Like, okay, here's a number pad. Hit the thing three times, whatever it is, that's in the chest. It seems like that's what they're doing. At least to me. In my uneducated state. Now, yes. <sighs> mm. You know, it's funny though. I knew that I had two days of work ahead of me. So when I was recording my other Let's Play of uh, Super Mario RPG, which is going on right now, uh, for those of you in the future that don't know what's exactly what's happening, uh, two days ago, I knew that I was going to be... No, three nights ago. Three nights ago, I knew that I was going to be 
busy with work the next couple days. So I'm like, okay guys, this is gonna be the first, or this is gonna be the last time that I record anything for about a week. And then, <laughs> the two days when I actually have to get up to go to work, I'm recording. In fact, in fact, I need to be at work in 12 hours. Exactly 12 hours from now, I'm going to be at work, punching my clock, getting in. Interesting. So I'll remind myself. I'll look at the clock, and when it's 4.32 p.m., I'll know that at this time, 12 hours ago, I was recording, and I was fighting the Fire Fiends. The Fire Fiend fucks. The Final Fantasy Fire Fiend fucks. That's, that's what it is. Jill, 69, why? Jill, I swear to God, if you die, heal yourself. Thank you. You're the one person I don't want to die. Well, technically, I don't want Gun to die, because the rest of you can fuck off. How much do they give? 800 experience. They give a damn lot, don't they? But they also take away a damn lot. Not the tent. I mean, look, we had 90, we had 90 something, and now we're down to 30 something. It's a good thing the heals are dirt cheap. Unlike the fucking cabins, or the pures. Ew, muck. Wait a minute, muck, didn't, uh, weren't we, didn't I see you guys in the first cave? Hold on, aren't you guys, like, level 5 enemies? Aren't you, aren't you just here to poison me? I don't think you're gonna do a lot of damage to me. I think you're just here to poison me. Like assholes. Yes, if you've ever, if you've ever fisted an asshole, you're gonna get poisoned by something. I can guarantee you. Especially if that man's name, or woman, especially if that person's name is Muck. What's your nickname? Muck? Ugh. No thanks. I do not want to engage in sexual intercourse with you. Good sir, madam, whatever. Either one. Whichever. I don't know, maybe... Question. Ratio. I know I could probably look at my demographics for you two, but ratio. Nowadays, how many of you are men and how many of you are women? Now, YouTube ratio does not really count anymore because you could say whatever you want. You could be a female and say that you're a guy. You could be a guy and say that you're a female. You know, because some people do that. So I don't really trust YouTube demographics. 4,000 gold. Awesome. That'll buy me one and one half of a cabin. Or a house. That's what it is. I can buy a whole house and plop it down. I like how the first time I ever saw the centipedes, millipedes, peds in general, there was four of them on screen. So it was the most busy looking screen ever. Good stuff. Only I could have that. Ugh, you guys poison me like God. God poisons me and laughs. Ugh. But, however, I would like to I would like to ask of the Final Fantasy Let's Plays that you guys have seen, Final Fantasy 1. I, I don't know how many there are out there. If you punch it into YouTube Final Fantasy Let's Play. Probably only a couple of them are going to show up at first, but that's not saying a lot. You need to go to about to page six on YouTube to actually see, you know, s videos with smaller, you know, actual Let's Plays. Because a lot of them are going to be Final Fantasy. As soon as you punch in the word Final Fantasy, you can guarantee on the first page you're going to see Sephiroth's smug face looking at you. So, I was wondering which of you was going to appear first, or uh, be the main person. So, actually, really look in depth to see other final or other Let's Plays. Now, I'm not exactly saying that my Let's Plays are going to be brand spanking new number one on the list, or anything like that. Because I know my Final Fantasy views don't get that much, or my Final Fantasy videos don't get that many views right now. But, they will eventually. I know, because I'm a, I think of myself as a very, what am I doing? I'm so used to that, I, that combination of people. 
Anyway, I, t I try to think of myself as a fairly decent Let's Player. Because I don't just swear, and I don't just talk about one thing, and I don't just repeat memes and internet hoo-ha of what's going on right now. I like to think of myself as somebody who actually comes up with a decent conversation. Not only about the game, but about what's going on in his life, what's going on in your life, what's going on here, there, yonder, and it actually makes it entertaining to listen to. That's what I like to think, because I put emotion into my things. I like to emote. I'm a very emotional person. I'll grab you vigorously with my emotion. At least I like to think I do. So, I would like to ask, of the other Final Fantasy Let's Plays, yeah, you've seen Final Fantasy 1, how does this one stack up? You know, is it subpar? Is it okay? Is it... You see, now, here's the thing. I usually don't like comparing myself to other people because just the fact of people trying to do Let's Plays is admirable. Because in my eyes, aside from vlogging, I think Let's Plays are just about the the lowest viewed videos there are. Now don't get me wrong, there are Let's Plays out there that have 3 million views, okay? But I am saying, of the people that do Let's Plays, on however many Let's Players there are, I haven't officially counted, there's probably about, I'd wager about 6,000 Let's Players. That's probably a very small number. That's probably infinitesimal compared to how many Let's Players there actually are. Active Let's Players. Fire fucks. At, of, of the active Let's Players, not a lot of them get a whole lot of views. Because either A, the quality sucks, B, the person sucks, or, or C, the game sucks to a certain degree where even the best quality and video, people don't want to see the shit. And this is, by the way, this is me philosophizing on Let's Players themselves, alright? Or the actual idea of Let's Playing. And what's funny about Let's Playing is that Let's Playing is almost like a vlog, or a blog, or whatever it is itself. Ooh, level 16. Because you're taking the person's experience and living it through with them. So it's kind of like a really long vlog, in my opinion. Giant! It's a giant! It is massive! It is huge! It is a giant weapon. Aw, oh, Jill can't equip it. Okay. If I, if I recall... 27. No. Let's see. Weapon. No. Status. Yes. 42. 42. 38. Screw your giant. Now, the giant sword might do more damage to smaller enemies. Or, it might do more damage to ogres. I'm, I don't know. I'm assuming. But I'm going with that magical, delicious silver axe. It's not the golden axe, it's the silver axe. But anyway, point I'm trying to make is, I think it takes an awful lot of balls to expect somebody to watch your Let's Plays. 